Good morning. We are back again in the in the infamous kitchen. Today is another little home challenge video. So this challenge is coordination with equipment. Okay, so this is what you are gonna need. Let me just flick you around. Oh, there we go. So you're gonna need a plate or a bowl, some cardboard, a pair of scissors, some salad tape, um, cling film, okay, or tin foil. Okay, and this is what we're gonna hopefully create. So we're gonna try and create a little tennis racket, okay, and then obviously some little tennis balls using the cling film or the tin foil. So it should look hopefully something like this. And just like that, we've got ourselves a little tennis racket. Now, when you do it, make sure you've got enough cardboard so you wanna make sure it's sturdy enough to be able to hit, okay? And hopefully you, your design will be better than what mine is. Okay, and I've made two balls now out of cling film and out of tin foil, okay? Okay, we're back. So, we have our tennis racket. Hopefully you guys managed to make yours okay. Um, hopefully it's a little better than mine is. Okay, mine's quite plain and boring. Okay, you can design yours if you want to. We've got a couple of challenges for you. So the first challenge is all about, okay, hitting, so coordination with our arms, okay, and our racket, so the equipment, okay, as well as catching, so we're using two body parts now. Now, you can either use a tin foil ball, okay, which is okay, a little bit heavier, or we can use a cling film one, which is a little bit lighter, a little bit easier. Now remember, these aren't perfect shapes, okay, mine's a little bit egg-shaped there, it's gonna be a little bit harder, okay, so just remember that when you were doing this challenge. So when I'm looking to hit and catching, if I can keep my racket nice and flat, okay, the ball should hopefully go up. If it's facing down or facing towards me or facing the side, then that's where the ball is gonna go. So just remember, in front of the body, okay, nice and flat. Now all I'm gonna do is just move my arm, okay, up and down like so. The harder and faster I move it, the higher the ball goes. Okay, so if I'm here, if I do a nice small movement, the ball goes quite low. If I do a harder movement, or oh, as a tester, it goes a little bit higher. So your little challenge is to see if you can hit and catch okay, your ball. If it's too easy, try and challenge yourself a little bit higher, okay, or you can try and balance on one leg and see if you can hit and catch. Have a little go at that one. 